Hi everybody, I'm Patrick Dockery. In my life, I have worn many hats and tasted many flavors. As I travel the world, I explore the finest cities in search for culture, history, and great food. Along the way, I get to meet today's most interesting celebrities, focusing on the positive side of life, allowing them to share their causes, charities, and what truly fascinates them. We cook and dine with some of the finest chefs of our time, preparing healthy and delicious meals in some of the hottest restaurants. Also, we showcase the latest, most creative, and hippest trends of beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. I pursue my passion for health and fitness and acquire some of the most innovative wellness strategies. And now I want to share this all with you. So come along on this amazing journey and together we will experience a world of health, beauty, and life. On today's show, we meet up with Chrisanna Northrup, CrossFit expert and best-selling author of The Normal Bar. We find out how to obtain and maintain a healthy, happy, and fulfilling life and relationships that last. Then we head to the Bay Area, San Francisco, to Izzy's Steakhouse and Chops for some mouth-watering food that has been delighting the locals for over 25 years. And last, we see how Invisalign is revolutionizing the way we smile. Come along on my personal journey with Invisalign from start to finish with results that'll have me smiling every week on Health Beauty Life. But first, let's hit the gym with Chrisanna Northrup. Today we're here with Chrisanna Northrup, the gorgeous Chrisanna Northrup. <laughs> Thank you. And where are we today? We're in some kind of CrossFit type. What's going on? I am the co-owner of CrossFit Del Mar. Okay. So uh, there's four of us that own this gym. Uh, we have Mark Merrick, uh, Esther Merrick, Kim Bono, and myself. And we wanted to have a gym that was big and welcomes everybody of all walks of life. So you're into fitness, obviously. Yes. Look at those guns. I didn't know we were going to have a gun show. <laughs> yes. Event. So you, you actually participate in CrossFit, huh? Yes, yes. Right. It and changed my life. It did change your life. Yes. When did you start with the CrossFit? I wasn't really working out, and I wasn't taking very good care of myself, and uh, didn't feel very good about the relationship, what was going on in life, and so forth. So I did a lot of self-reflecting, and um, I was one of those people that thought that you could only get in shape if you had good genetics. That, nah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, right. I went to a CrossFit gym just two blocks from my house, and tried it out and I realized how out of shape I was. It was just an amazing transformation and once you start seeing some results, you don't want to stop. And then you have this amazing book that's come out. Yes, I came up with the concept of the patterns that my husband and I created were never, weren't working for us anymore. Neither one of us were very happy. So um, I decided to look at what other people were doing around the world, um, figure out what was normal, and then look at the extremely happy normal. Okay. And what are those people doing differently than everyone else? And what and can sustainable, I sustainable, right? You know. Yeah, and what can I learn from them? And I didn't want to know just the general public. I want to know somebody same age as me, same amount of kids, sure. you know. So I, I, I did the survey so you can actually see how you compare to your peers. Oh, okay. And then how did you go about doing that? So I um, decided to partner with a couple media partners, uh, Reader's Digest, um, also ARP and they loved it, so they helped uh, promote the survey, and we had almost 100,000 people take it. Wow. Yeah, around the world. So this book right here, yeah. The Normal Bar, with a little heart with a check mark. The surprising secrets of happy couples and what they reveal about a new normal in your relationship. And um, as far as the pictures go, I have a very short attention span. <laughs> so I bring in all the data and infographics through cartoons and visuals so people can really grasp it. Because data is actually pretty boring, but if you bring it through some fun cartoons and graphics, I actually show a bar on what's normal, the normal bar. Yeah. And then I look at the extremely happy and unhappy, and it's just very visual. It's, it's a lot easier to digest. Well, they always say that a picture's worth a thousand words, yes. and it really is. Yes. When you can see something, it means so much more to you, and a lot of people respond really well to visual. A absolutely. And speaking of that, of visuals, I mean, some of the some of the suggestions are is visual simulation or yes. maybe toys, and there's so many things that you found out. Yeah. So one of the things that, uh, that really jumped out, well, there's a lot of things, but um, men and women both want more variety. And one of the biggest things is I want more passion, I want more variety in my relationship. Mm -hmm. And then when we looked at um, sexual temptations, why we asked people that cheated, why did you cheat? And it was usually because they wanted more variety. They, you know, they weren't getting enough at home that they, they looked good, they felt good, you know, their partner wasn't 
wasn't telling them enough. So I wrote the book for somebody that's kind of looking at their own relationship. Do I have realistic or unrealistic goals? You know, so okay. that's... It's a good place to start. Yeah, and, that's, yeah. and that's what this does. It, you know, hey, yeah, you're realistic or unrealistic, and it gives you a sense yeah, of where you're like, at. What, what are other people? Yeah, doing? exactly. You know, put, Just, put me in relationship to the reality of this world. It gives you a sense of where you're at. And I hear, you know, you're not stopping here. There's a lot more in the future for you. Yes, actually, we have all the, all the research and data for singles. So the second book will be um, What's Normal in Singles and Dating. Oh, wow. So that'll I'll be, be really curious interesting. To find that out. What people are doing around the world, what the dating yeah. scene looks like, and what works, what doesn't work. There's a lot of people that have a big challenge there. I mean, the nightclub scene, the yes. bar scene. I mean, there's so much, and there's the internet. Online which is crazy. dating. Everybody's faking who they are, and it's, yeah. it's hard to dig through all that, isn't it? Yeah, absolutely. So, and the normal bar is going to be a, a full brand. So, relationships, singles, and dating. I think the third book I want to have on health, fitness, and nutrition what's normal, what works for people, Ooh. that sort of thing looking at, again, I look at the United States, but then I like to drizzle in other countries. Sure. Very interested in what other people are doing, where we're the same or the different. That's amazing. Yeah, it's really fun. <laughs> well, I heard that uh, you're going to give us some uh, workout tips too next. Yes, I am. So you're going to change up. I know you got the, the hurt leg. <laughs> yes. And how did you how did you hurt that leg? Dirt biking. Dirt biking. <laughs> Do dirt biking. All right. So you're going to show us stuff that you can do with a broken leg, right? I'll, I'll do what I can. <laughs> Sounds good. I can't wait to check that <laughs> out. Stick around. We're getting ready to get our sweat on with Chrisanna. If you like what you see on Health Beauty Life, there's no need to wait till next week's show because there's a lot more to experience. And it's all just a click away at healthbeautylife.com. Stop by and experience our extended play and behind the scenes interviews. And be sure to become a Health Beauty Life VIP. You'll be eligible to win valuable prizes, receive newsletters, special offers, and updates. Healthbeautylife.com connects our world with your world at healthbeautylife.com. Beautiful hair starts with beautiful color. At Enjoy Professional Hair Care, we know what it takes to maintain beautiful and vibrant hair color. With our gentle, sulfate-free, pH-balanced formulas, with Color Keeper technology, we take the guesswork out of maintaining beautiful color. Most products don't address the main cause of fading hair color, which is a high pH. When pH levels are too high, the cuticle of the hair shaft is forced wide open, allowing the color molecules to simply wash away down the drain with your time and money. Enjoy professional line of shampoos and conditioners are pH balanced and stable, locking in the color molecules, keeping your hair looking sexy, shiny, and beautiful. So the next time you're thinking about your hair color, just remember to enjoy. How do you define beauty? Is it the way you look or how you feel? Or does it come from within? At Enjoy Professional Hair Care, we believe the question doesn't even matter. Beautiful hair is as easy as remembering to enjoy. Let us recommend the right products for your hair type and find an Enjoy Professional Salon near you at enjoyhaircare.com. And just remember to enjoy. Welcome back. It's time to get fit with CrossFit and Chris Santa Northrup. Kipping pull up is using your hips. Okay. So not everybody can just go up there and just do a dead hang pull up right. because that's a lot of upper body strength. Yeah. And that's so the goal. It is. It is the goal. But and we'll show them that. Yeah. We're like, let's be efficient. Let's bring in some other body parts and let's get you to do what you need to do without killing yourself. Okay. All right. All right. okay. <laughs> so for a kipping pull up, you want to use your hips more. So I use my hips to pull up. I'll see almost kicking. So, yep. I use my hips and I'm pushing away. Get the kipping pull-ups, kind of using that hips and that body weight in, and then you can start working on the dead hang. Okay, so you're hanging. So you're dead hang, and you simply pull yourself all the way up. And those are never easier. No, <laughs> no, they're not. And they're definitely not easy with extra weight on <laughs> extra there. Extra weight, yeah. Right on. We got some kettlebells yeah, the here. Kettlebells are also people sometimes think the kettlebells are for the arms. They immediately think, yeah. oh, I'm lifting a kettlebell. It's all about the arms. When it's really more about the core. Okay. Again, using your hamstrings and your hips and your, your core body to get that kettlebell up and moving along. Right, well. So we always start people with the smaller kettlebell just to kind of get used to even swinging it and feeling comfortable right. with it. So, so, and again, I always tell people when you grab the kettlebell, it's almost like an angry gorilla. You don't want to ever just bend over and grab it. Yeah, you want to bend it like this. Rawr! 
<laughs> just like well, there you go. Right <laughs> so I always make that noise. Yeah, All well, right. that's good. We like that. We appreciate that, okay? Now, that's not part of the normal technique, is it? <laughs> you know, it's part it of my technique. Be, it could be, right? <laughs> it's a good way to pick up the kettlebell. You want to have your feet right outside your hips and just using your hips to pull it up. Okay. So it's not arms. It's your arms are nice and straight, and it's just hips. Okay. Just pulling it right up. See, it can be done. Yes. There's no yes. excuse. And yes. she's got a baby broken steps, leg. Baby, baby steps. steps, right? Yeah, baby steps. Right, and then another thing you want to show us was the, the wall and the ball. Yeah, yeah. Now, what's that called, though? Uh, we call them wall balls. A oh, wall ball. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Hey, imagine that, you know? <laughs> we call them wall balls. Okay, well, let's go on over there and okay. check that one out. I didn't grab one. Cool. Wall balls. <laughs> well, you got me over here in the wall area, and you got a ball and a wall. Yes, I do. So that's all you need, right? <laughs> that's all you need. And with the ball, we start light. Right, and the there's beginning. different weights of balls. Absolutely. Okay. We, we go from six all the way to 25. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, so we so start. What's that right there? This one, I think, is 12. Okay. So this one's 12 pounds. So with the wall ball, you want to put it right up here. Okay. Elbows out. Again, you're in that squat position where your feet are right outside your hips. I gotta put this foot out a little bit more because of the broken leg. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, again, squat down, throw the ball up, hit the target, and catch wow. it as it comes down. And keeping my chest up, keeping that chest up. Yeah. So, um, and that's why going against the wall really helps you keep that chest up Absolutely. and driving from the heels. Yeah, and it does so much because it's such a core and- Yeah, oh. core, hamstrings, and butt again. I noticed some tires over there when we were a little earlier. Yes, yeah. So you have different sizes. So let's go over there and show us how to use those Yeah, tires. that's a lot of fun. This looks pretty interesting, so let's check it out. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, we're back over here with the tires, and I know you should have three different sizes, and just like everything else. Baby steps. Baby steps. Okay, yes. so that looks like a, and you had a smaller tire than this, I think, a little baby, yeah. baby yeah. wheelbarrow tire. <laughs> yes, we have a very small one. So how does it start out with this little small tire? Well, you, you can use the small tire just to get people, again, used to getting in the position to flip a tire. And, and flipping a tire not only builds strength and core, but it's also fun. Yeah. It gets you outside. It's different. You can do it inside and outside, and it's different, exactly, and it's functional movement. On the bigger tires, you have to really make sure you have a decent grip. So there's okay. some, some, some tires you just can't even grip, and if you can't grip it, don't, don't try to. Yeah, don't even don't go any, Don't even go there. This actually has really good positioning to grip on, so I can get my hands under there pretty easily. Again, I'm, I, I'm driving from my heels. I'm in my squat. I'm keeping my chest up and just lifting it right up. And then again, you can use your knee if you need to. Yeah, I saw that. Over. Use your knee to stabilize it. Just like that. You did good. <laughs> Why the hammer, believe it or not, is also a nice little core yes. because if you're all loosey goosey. And hey, guess what? You know, you're talking about relationships, right? Yes. After you swing the sledgehammer a few times, you're not mad anymore, are you? No, you're not. And you okay. get rid of all that aggression. All right. Work, kids. So on the sledgehammer, we lift it up, our hand comes down, and we hit it really hard. Just like that. That's got to feel good. It's really fun. Yeah, you're like done. Yeah, it's so like, fun. Mix this in with the pull-ups and the wall balls, and every day it's different, and we have some only lifting. We have a little bit of everything. It's a lot of fun mixing Great. it up. Yeah, well, thanks so much. Having fun with it. I know. <laughs> you are. You're so fun. This is so fun. Yeah. Thanks so much, by the way. Yeah, and thank you. This was amazing. And thank you so much for being here with us. And until next time, just remember to enjoy. enjoy. Coming up next, we head to Izzy's Steak and Chops. How do you define beauty? Is it the way you look or how you feel? Or does it come from within? At Enjoy Professional Hair Care, we believe the question doesn't even matter. Beautiful hair is as easy as remembering to enjoy. Let us recommend the right products for your hair type and find an Enjoy Professional Salon near you at enjoyhaircare.com. And just remember to enjoy. If you like what you see on Health Beauty Life, there is no need to wait till next week's show because there's a lot more to experience. And it's all just a click away at healthbeautylife.com. Stop by and experience our extended play and behind the scenes interviews. And be sure to become a Health Beauty Life VIP. You'll be eligible to win valuable prizes, receive newsletters, special offers, and updates. Healthbeautylife.com connects our world with your world at healthbeautylife.com. Enjoy, to receive pleasure or satisfaction, to feel or perceive with pleasure, to be delighted with, to enjoy great hair seven days a week. So, 
What is your definition? To enjoy great hair, visit enjoyhaircare.com. Go to our product recommender to answer six simple questions and let us select the best products for your hair type. Use the salon locator to find Enjoy Hair Care near you. And just remember to enjoy. Welcome back to the infamous Izzy Steak and Chops. Hi everybody, today we're here at Izzy's in San Francisco and we're with Mark Epstein. How you doing Mark? Doing well. Yeah, well, you know, before we get started, I need to ask you a question. Who in the heck is Izzy? Izzy was uh, one of the most notorious saloon keepers in San Francisco. He was something of a local legend, um, famous for feeding people that, that didn't have any money. And in fact, during Prohibition was incarcerated multiple times uh, for selling uh, moonshine, yeah. uh, but while in prison apparently uh, was able to uh, create enough moonshine to get himself set free. Right, and then now Izzy's is a, just an amazing restaurant. Um, but really we are value for dollar, we're uh, um, a neighborhood restaurant, right. we do very little advertising, so most everybody that comes here comes here by word of mouth and uh, we're very, very local and proud of that. Yeah, well I can't wait to get started with the food. Uh, Let's do it. Right on. Cheers, man. Well, here we are back in the kitchen with Junior, and uh, hi, Junior, how are you? I'm doing good. Yeah, we're gonna do a pork chop. One of your famous pork chops, huh? Oh, yeah, Jupiter berries, uh -huh. cumin seed, and uh, coriander seeds. We got rosemary, thyme, uh -huh. parsley, and garlic. Yeah. Awesome, so you, you pre-chop these up? Yes, sir. In fact, your dad works in here with you. Yeah. And your dad prepped these up for us. Yeah, just um, chop it up, and we just put them all together. Okay, so you're gonna go put it in there? So and you have an orange here now. Show me what's up with the orange, because that kind of binds everything together. Yeah, it does. The only thing you do is just cut them up. You know, no, no biggie, just into four. Oh wow, okay. And just put in your water. So when you see a boil, just take it out, let it cool down. Okay, very good. And then I know you had some pre-prepared here. Yes. You just put the pork chop, put it in, put in your walk-in. 45 minutes. 45 minutes? Yeah. We can't just have meat. I mean, we got to make a salad, right? Right about that. Yeah, you know, you got some good mixed greens and you're going to make your special dressings. Okay, just a little bit of rosemary. Okay, love rosemary. A little bit of thyme. Got to have the thyme, right? So a little bit of shallots. Okay. I'm going to dice them up. Dice them up. You like them fine? Kind of? Yeah, a lot of people lo love our salads here. Put a little bit of shallots. Shallots, yeah. It's so easy, huh? Oh, yeah. But you got to get the right ingredients and you got to yeah. do it right. Okay. Dice it up a little bit more. Okay. Release a little of the flavor. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. And you got some salt and pepper? Dash of salt. And then, of course, good old olive oil and vinegar, olive, huh? Yeah. And then we got our mixed greens right here. Just pour it in? Yeah. So you just get the tongs and mix it up, huh? That looks good. I can't wait to try that. What are we going to mix this one with? I know you got mixed greens. Are you going to get a nice, I think you're saying that you're going to bring a New York steak yeah, or something? Yeah, we are. All right, and your dad's going to bring that. He already has that cooked, so. Oh, yeah, he has it cooked. Oh, my gosh. That thing looks gorgeous. You even put grill marks on the side. Yeah. Sure. It looks good. It's beautiful. A lot of years of experience, huh? Yeah, 30 years. 30 years. Wow. Now, that's a meal. That looks gorgeous. Well, we'll set this down and we'll come back and try everything. We'll try the pork chop, everything in a minute. Yeah, sounds great. And we got one more dish coming which is my favorite, and that is the skirt steak. The skirt yeah, steak. That's, that's our, our, our Izzy's right there. That is, big time. We don't want to do it, we want to overdo it well done, because it's not going to taste so good. Right. And we don't want to underdo it as well. Right. Right now, I'm just, what I'm doing is just marking it up. Okay, yeah. which is like a diamond pattern, right? Yes. That's pretty good. That's about medium right there? Medium rare. Yeah. Medium rare. Perfect medium rare. Okay. 
Well, you know, this is my favorite part. We got actually three dishes. You see, sometimes we only do one or two, but today we have three. Since, you know, you were behind the scenes cooking all this, I want you to eat it with us, okay? Okay. We'll all try it at once. I want to try the skirt. You're going to try the skirt? Ah. Oh. Everybody, all at the same time. Oh my gosh. I guess your experience pays off all those years. It's absolutely delicious. I'm gonna get a little of this pork here, around the edge. Nice medium rare piece. Oh my gosh. This is ridiculous. This, the brining, are you kidding? I mean, it's like, the meat's so good. It's nice to have vegetables, but gotta eat the meat first. Oh my gosh. Okay. I almost thought the pork chop was gonna be my favorite, but man, I gotta go back to the skirt. Everybody you gotta get out to Izzy's. It's amazing when you're in San Francisco. It's a must, you gotta go. It's, it's unbelievable, it'll blow your mind. And thank you so much for being with us. And until next time, just remember to enjoy. enjoy. Next up, the clear choice in teeth straightening Invisalign. If you like what you see on Health Beauty Life, there's no need to wait till next week's show because there's a lot more to experience and it's all just a click away at healthbeautylife.com. Stop by and experience our extended play and behind the scenes interviews and be sure to become a Health Beauty Life VIP. You'll be eligible to win valuable prizes, receive newsletters, special offers, and updates. Healthbeautylife.com connects our world with your world at healthbeautylife.com. How do you define beauty? Is it the way you look or how you feel? Or does it come from within? At Enjoy Professional Hair Care, we believe the question doesn't even matter. Beautiful hair is as easy as remembering to enjoy. Let us recommend the right products for your hair type and find an Enjoy Professional Salon near you at enjoyhaircare.com. And just remember to enjoy. Beautiful hair starts with beautiful color. At Enjoy Professional Hair Care, we know what it takes to maintain beautiful and vibrant hair color. With our gentle, sulfate-free, pH-balanced formulas, with Color Keeper technology, we take the guesswork out of maintaining beautiful color. Most products don't address the main cause of fading hair color, which is a high pH. When pH levels are too high, the cuticle of the hair shaft is forced wide open allowing the color molecules to simply wash away down the drain with your time and money. Enjoy professional line of shampoos and conditioners are pH balanced and stable, locking in the color molecules, keeping your hair looking sexy, shiny, and beautiful. So the next time you're thinking about your hair color, just remember to enjoy. We're back, it's time to straighten up with Invisalign. Well, today we're here with my favorite dentist, Dr. Grant Layton. Hey Grant, how you doing? Pretty good. Yeah, well today's the day. Today's the day that I get to start straightening my teeth. You talked to me about a thing called Invisalign. Invisalign is uh, braces for adults. Okay. It's the uh, modern day braces for adults. You can't see them when you're wearing them. And uh, they straighten teeth like braces that you're in charge. Yep. You can take them out when you're eating and they're uh, a very nice way to straighten your teeth and you can whiten your teeth with the Invisalign trays. So here we have a, uh, a digital image of Patrick's teeth. Those, so are, those are crooked, definitely. The, yeah, these are very turned and crowded. Every two weeks as he gets a new tray, the teeth will be straightened and straightened and moved. So Dr. Layton, I know you're gonna be putting these buttons on my teeth. What, what are they made out of? Um, here, let me show you. Okay. They're made out of a, a porcelain on my finger? Oh, oh, yeah, let me put this on your finger. This is a porcelain in a resin matrix. So that the, uh, so it's mostly porcelain. But if we can, when we cure the resin. It's a liquid right now, I it, know. Yeah, but when we, cure the, when we cure the resin, it will turn into something very much like tooth. It has a light activated catalyst. Dr. Layton continues the process of creating the nubs that will hold the trays in place. He only dabs a little of the porcelain liquid on the teeth and uses a light to cure them. All right, so now those are cured. So we're gonna look at the bottom ones now, and if we go to the lower left, let me fill that first. 
The liquid actually has an ingredient that is activated by the light, making it a solid piece of porcelain on the tooth. These will later be removed after the teeth are straightened. So these are your first trays. First, okay. first try in. They'll have to slip over the buttons, and you can feel the pressure on your teeth. Well, yeah. Yeah. Well, after a couple of days, that, that pressure goes away okay. as the teeth move. But as the teeth put a little pressure, the bone will actually move, and the tooth will move, and new bone will grow behind it, so the tooth actually moves in the bone. Oh, okay. We'll put this right like this. I'll make sure your, your cheek is out of the way. We'll come around, make sure your cheek is out of the way here. Pop it on. Well, I mean, hopefully I still sound the same. I, it feels a little different, but not too bad, actually. You sound, you sound the same to me. You sound the same? Yeah. You got it. I'm looking forward to it, and we'll be seeing everybody in about uh, 46 months, which is about right the time I turn uh, another one year older. And that's my, that's my present to myself, is nice straight teeth. So I'm excited, so we'll see you in a bit. Well, here I am back after, how long has it been, Dr. Layton, since I've been on the Invisalign? Four months? 13 weeks 13 from the weeks. start. Well, we're just gonna make one more step as, as far as bringing your teeth together and making them straight. Yeah, so we're gonna do a little filing. With a little bit of filing. Okay, good. Because the teeth will need room to move to their correct position, Dr. Layden has to create space in between the teeth. He does this by simply grinding a minimal amount of enamel off the side of the tooth, after which he checks the measurements, ensuring a proper amount of space exists. Pretty easy process, everybody. So pretty soon, straight teeth. Gotta love it. After one year and several sets of trays, my smile is now perfectly shaped. The transformation is unbelievable, as you can see with what I started with and the final results of my perfect smile. Dr. Layton made the process a breeze, and I recommend the Invisalign process to anyone who desires a more confident and better looking smile. And as I always say, just remember to enjoy. If you like what you see on Health Beauty Life, there's no need to wait till next week's show because there's a lot more to experience and it's all just a click away at healthbeautylife.com. Stop by and experience our extended play and behind the scenes interviews, travel, cooking, fitness, beauty, fashion, and lifestyles, as well as any shows that you've missed. Of course, you can connect and share through Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and YouTube, and be sure to become a Health Beauty Life VIP. You'll be eligible to win valuable prizes, receive newsletters, special offers, and updates. Travel with us to share our unique visits to everybody's favorite cities and towns and learn to prepare delicious healthy meals in your kitchen with our step-by-step -step recipes. Discover the beauty and fashion tips of today's best and brightest with how-to videos that make it easy to get the hottest new looks. Get fit and stay healthy with leading fitness, nutrition, and wellness experts. HealthBeautyLife.com connects our world with your world at HealthBeautyLife.com. Okay, welcome back. Thanks to all of our guests on this week's show. And how did you how did you hurt that leg? Dirt biking. Dirt biking. <laughs> Just dirt biking. All right. And what's that called though? Um, we call them wall balls. A wall ball. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Hey, imagine that. You know. We call them wall balls. Okay. Well, let's go on over there. Okay. Check that one out. I didn't grab one. Cool. Wall balls. <laughs> as far as the pictures go, I have a very short attention span, <laughs> and I'm. You mean if you see something shiny, you're like. <laughs> I'm like ah. <laughs> so when I bend it like this, <laughs> just like that. <laughs> And until next time, just remember to enjoy.